now we see the uh, midpoint problem see generally what we have seen so far is uh, again a projection straight line in time to blur the planes but there uh, we considered the one end preferably the left end as the hinge point with respect to the left end we tilted the line this way that way but here instead of uh, considering the left end you have to consider the midpoint through the midpoint you will, we will be tilting the line okay so that is the only difference otherwise there is no difference between this with the previous problems we'll see the problem the midpoint of a line ab 75 mm long is 25 above 40 in front it is inclined at 30 to hp 52 vp draw the projection you see how many values 1 2 3 4 and 5 so we'll proceed so this is the problem here instead of considering the left end or right end considering the we, we will consider the midpoint of the problem if the line ab if li line is ab say 75 mm long means the midpoint m will be at the middle of ab that is uh, 37.5 mm this way 37.5 that way that is the only difference okay so that is a dash b1 dash length is equal to 75 a1 dash m dash equal to m dash b1 dash is equal to half of ab 75 divided by 2 37.5 okay so this is the preliminary front view line complete the preliminary front view set the trapezium a1 dash b1 dash b1 a1 is the preliminary front view set follow the similar kind of procedure for the preliminary top view by considering 75 on 50 angle okay a to b2 length is 75 its angle is 50 this is the preliminary top view uh, complete the preliminary top view set by drawing projectors so the trapezium a to b to b2 dash a2 dash is the preliminary top view set okay hereafter the steps are almost common okay uh, through b1 dash a1 dash a2 b2 draw locus then the next step is with the m dash as center b2 dash radius draw r get b dash follow the same this side with m dash as center a2 dash as radius draw r at get a dash okay now draw line joining a dash b dash it will pass through it must pass through m dash okay that is the final front view let us see here with m as center m b1 as radius draw arc this way again with m as center m a1 as radius draw arc that way thereby you can get a and b draw line joining a and b it will pass through m that is nothing but the final uh, top view as the final check draw a projector from a dash it must pass through a draw a projector from b dash it must pass through b okay 